Acer shares closed limit down today following yesterday's negative financial reports and the resignation of chairman and CEO J.T. Wong. The Taiwanese computer maker will begin a major revamp that will soon see corporate president Jim Wong take over as CEO. Third quarter losses at Acer exceeded 13 billion NT, or 4.8 NT dollars per share, setting a historical record. To accept responsibility, Acer chairman and CEO J.T. Wong announced his resignation. After I took over as president of Acer, the company soared into the clouds, though recently it has fallen to earth. I regret and apologize for the consecutive losses we have experienced over the past few years. To return to past prosperity, Acer plans to trim 7 percent of its global workforce and turn over executive duties to Acer corporate president Jim Wong. Acer also plans to invite its founder Stan Shea to offer guidance after eight years of retirement. The board of directors has decided to establish a reform committee and will invite director Stan Shea to serve as its convener. After the financial report and news of Wong's resignation was made public, Acer shares ended limit down today. The key was right off of intangible assets. It exceeded market expectations and led to today's extreme price volatility. Despite this recent round of negative news, analyst Xu Chongsun expressed optimism in Acer's ability to recover.